got to be comfortable with your manhood to admit what 53-year-old Ray Matterson is about to tell you. That after finishing all his macho weekend chores, this divorced father of three from Troy, New York, loves nothing more than to be able to go inside, settle into the couch, and embroider. It doesn't get any better than that. I never get bored with it. He's been doing it for 20 years. And if you think he looks like an unlikely embroiderer now, wait till you see what he looked like when he started. Yes, that's the very same Ray Matterson, former inmate at the Connecticut State Penitentiary. He came here for robbery, he says, to feed his coke habit. When you're a practicing addict, you can justify just about anything you do. He spent nearly eight years in prison, where to pass the time, one day he took some thread from a sock, borrowed a needle from the guard, made a hoop out of a Rubbermaid container, and ripped up a pair of boxers to embroider onto. You had to get I teased did, I about did get it. teased. Guy doesn't say to you in the holding tank, when you get to the joint, you get yourself an embroidery hoop. <laughs> It'll earn their respect. <laughs> Undaunted, he kept at it day and night and still continues now 13 years after his release. His work is highly prized and on display now at a gallery at UC Davis near Sacramento. Each piece is about the size of a credit card. And although not exactly grandma friendly, you can't help but appreciate the talent and detail. In prison, you could buy one of these for a carton of cigarettes. Now they go for up to four grand. It easily pays the rent. But Ray says this has never been about money skills with how to deal with life, like gaining patience, like being able to start a project and finish it, which is really important in, in the real world. That's why Ray is now trying to start embroidery programs in prisons across the country. To raise money for launching the idea, he plans to sell his latest masterpiece, a one-of-a-kind work of art that he hopes will go for more than any other piece he's ever done. What do you think? Will it? Ray has been working on that all week, and now he just has to put the CBS logo right on the hat there. And ideally, Katie, he'd like to get one of your socks to finish it off. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, that makes me a tad nervous, but I'll do it. You'll do it? Okay. And he's so talented. Yeah, I mean, it's just like the work you. is... It, it, or at yeah. least you can tell it's a woman, right? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Why the baseball cap, I'm not so sure. So we can but put I'm the logo on there. He thinks I'm sporty, right? No, it's for the logo. Oh, that was so nice. And he'll appreciate the sock. Yeah, okay. okay. I'll bring it to you on Monday. Great.